The Last Breath is a returning Trials of the Nine auto rifle now available once again in Season of the Lost. So this one is a decent auto rifle in the adaptive frame category, meaning with the right rolls, this one is going to help you tear through enemies in PvE or in PvP. Well, today I'm going to have a look at The Last Breath, the stats the God Rolls to chase for PvP and PvE, plus how to get The Last Breath in Destiny 2. Well, if you're new around here or find this useful, don't forget to hit that subscribe button down below for all the latest Destiny 2 content and turn on notifications by hitting that bell. Well, the Last Breath is a kinetic auto rifle with an adaptive frame, meaning it's got a well-rounded grip, it's reliable and it's sturdy. Looking at the stats, we've got 21 for impact, 48 for range, 49 for stability, 70 for handling, 56 for reload speed, it's a 600 rounds per minute auto rifle with 43 in the magazine. Well, the last breath sits in the adaptive frame, meaning it's a 600 rounds per minute auto rifle, and it has some pretty decent competition in that class. So Noring Hunger, the famous reckoning weapon from Season of the Drifter, is a really strong contender in this slot. However, that one is a void energy weapon, but Noring Hunger does outperform this one on range, but the last breath does have great base handling stats. Scathe Lock is another 600 RPM auto rifle come back to us this season, which has very similar stats and performance to last breath, so that one is an alternative if you like the adaptive frame auto rifles. Well next up, let's have a look at the Last Breath God Roll Guide. So for PvE, Corkscrew Rifling, Ricochet Round, Subsistence and Frenzy would be a decent roll. So Corkscrew gives you more range and stability, and Ricochet Rounds gives you more stability and range again. Subsistence partially reloads the magazine from reserves when you defeat targets, and Frenzy gives you increased damage, handling and reload when you are in combat. For PvP, Chambered Compensator, Armor Piercing Rounds, Killing Wind, Range Finder would be a good option. So Chambered Compensator gives you more stability and recoil control, but slightly reduces handling, and Armor Piercing Rounds slightly increases range, which is really, really good in PvP. Killing Wind gives you increased mobility and range and handling for a short duration of final blows, and Range Finder gives you more range. Again, a great combination for PvP. Well, next up, let's have a look at how to get the last breath in Destiny 2. So to get this one, you want to run the Prophecy Dungeon, and you can find this in the tower, and ideally, you'll need a fire team of three to complete it. You can do it solo, of course, but that's going to take much more time. And for the last breath, you want to focus on the second encounter, that is the cube. So defeat the Taken there, and you'll have a chance for this one to drop for you. Well, finally, let's have a look at a little bit of history with the last breath. So the last breath was originally introduced when Destiny 2 launched in 2017 as part of Trials of the Nine. And Trials of the Nine was an endgame 4v4 Crucible event in Destiny 2, and the replacement for Trials of Osiris from Destiny 1. It was available every weekend from Friday until recent on Tuesday, and since the release of Forsaken, it was put on indefinite hiatus, and has now been replaced in Season of the Worthy by its predecessor, Trials of Osiris. Well, let me know down in the comments what you think of The Last Breath, and let me know what roles you got. Well, that is it for this guide for how to get The Last Breath in Destiny 2, and as always, thank you so much for watching. For more Destiny 2 content like this, hit that subscribe button down below and subscribe to This Week in Video Games. If you want to join the community, check out the Discord link in the description, or you can follow me on Twitter at TWIVG Podcast. If you enjoyed this video, found it useful, liking and sharing the video would really help me out. Otherwise, check out the other videos on the channel. Thanks again. I'll see you soon.
Your end will I return. 